uh this is welcome back this is a uh, solution to snakebird level star three this level uh is interesting uh first we obviously have to get uh the red snake out um but also working backwards looking at the end we notice that the distance from the exit to this cloud is one two three four one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, I guess eight. Uh, so there's no way for the snakes to get there directly. So we will need, the last snake will not be able to exit there. So we will need to move the, the block over, uh, over here. And I think maybe it's a hint that the cloud is shaped the same as the block. Uh, basically if we can move the block over to here, then the last snake being the, the longest snake, the red snake, um, can exit. And actually any of the snakes can exit at that point. So we know we need to move uh, this block over and get it onto this cloud. Um, to do that, uh, we're going to have to push it uh, on top of another snake. So but we need to get under this cloud. Uh, and so it's it's at least three tall. And then if we have a snake that it sits on and then a snake that pushes it, that's the goal. Uh, so basically we want the snakes all pointing to the left. Uh, but before we do that, let's get the snake out. Not a lot of choices here on first moves. Um, we need to lift. We need to lift the block uh, at least two spaces. Um, so we need to, using only the green and the blue, we need to get up to this height, this level. Uh, so we're going to stack the the heads of the blue and green snake on top of each other so that we can then push um the the block up okay let's start so it's not quite high enough but that is okay so now the red snake is free um and i think we can actually go either direction left or right um, with the red snake, let's do that. So the trick with going to the right is when we come back. Let's see, how does this work? We just need to make sure, you know, uh, when it falls down now, when the, when the red snake comes back, we need to make sure it doesn't fall into the spikes, uh, which is fine because of where the the, the green snake is positioned. Okay. I think we can now move the green snake over. We want the red snake last tail to go here, to be here basically, facing, facing to the left. And then the blue snake will be here. The head of the blue snake will be here, pointing to the left, so we can push uh push this across and then the green snake we just have to turn it around which is easy so maybe we do that first and can we do this yes this is fine there we go there we go. Now we're able to push uh, the block across. Oops. <laughs> Order. Uh, and I believe the green snake can fall. Okay. So now let's stop and take a second to look at this. Okay. 
we want to get the the block across to the to the cloud from block from here needs to get onto here which is not too bad but then we also need to get the snakes across uh the red snake is the only one If there's a snake on here, and it's going to go over here, it needs to be four long to be able to, to, to jump the chasm. And then after that, from here, if it's four long, one, it can climb above one step. So the red snake is going to go down to this cloud um, and then go across to the left. Go to this cloud, then jump into this cloud, then go here, and then eventually exit. The red, the red snake also, while it's down here, it can act as a platform for these three-length snake to go across, and then the, the three-length snakes can then climb over here. Okay, so we can go ahead and move the red snake. Let's keep the blue snake under it. I'm not sure it needs to. Okay, now the green snake can move. I think actually it's that's fine. So what are you trying to do here? The green snake moves over, and the blue can do that, the green can lift, and the green can even go over? Yeah, I think that's fine. Okay. Now all the snakes are over, so let's get red. The three length snakes are over, so let's get red into position. And we have to get red into position first because if we drop the block, where Red's head is currently sitting, uh, there's no way for Red to get up. Okay, from here, I think we want... Red to be underneath, and then we stack their heads. There we go. And then everybody can exit. There we go. And that's the solution to Star 3. Thanks for watching.